The message from Harrison, Sophia, and Mark Anthony. You can come in that same order. A child of God, I am powerful beyond measure. I was born to shine. Yes. I feel the light. I see the light. I am the light. I am a child of God. Sophia. I am a child of God. I believe everyone and everything are children of God. It has taken me time on my own journey to understand that God is not without, God is within. To me, it is the recognition of the inseparation, the inseparation from divine mind that solidifies this image in my, in my mind, my heart, and my life. When I could see that I don't have to search for some foreign entity or sign to find the answers, I just have to search within, a weight lifted off my shoulders, and a sense of peace echoed through my being and began to manifest before my eyes. Everything is happening at once, so of course I come back to that place of doubt. But all I need to do to stay connected to that deepest dimension of myself is to stop, breathe, and listen anytime, anywhere. Good morning, church family. I was asked to speak events in my life and God's perfect action showed me to get out of the situations that I was stayed. God had my back. When first asked, I had a general idea of what I was going to say. And then as the time came closer to write it down, nothing would come to mind. So I think it's fair to say that God had my back in preparing this presentation because gradually the moments that I'm going to share with you came to mind little by little. So there was the time when my art homework was due. I hadn't done my homework that day. The policy at my school is that if you don't do your homework, you get a detention. But God had my back. Sarah was absent. Then there was another time at school and my friends and I were playing with a bow and arrow that we, I had made for drama. I must say that it was a good bow and arrow. We fired pencils at stuff with it. We didn't fire at people, we were just using trees as practice targets. And we fired in the sky to see how far the pencils would go. Anyway, I was using it when something made me put it down on the ground and walk away from it. Just then, the principal rounded the corner. If she had seen me holding the fake bow and arrow, I would be in trouble for sure, because we're not allowed to have weapons at school, even fake ones. But God sure had my back that time. <laughs> God again had my back when I, was take, take, when I took my GSAT two years ago. I knew I, what school I wanted to attend. I prayed hard, I worked hard, and even though at first it didn't look as if my prayers were answered, I spent months worrying about whether or not I passed with the school I wanted. I am now at Campion, the school of my first choice. Not all my saves are school ones. God had my back when he gave me two loving parents that care about me and my well-being and are supportive in every way. Yes. God's blessings can be small, but no less precious. I was blessed with a precious moment on Thursday afternoon of last week when I saw a peahen, which if you didn't know is a female peacock, 
in our backyard. Now, I had no idea that peacocks were anywhere in Jamaica except for zoos or sanctuaries. I watched it until I had to go inside and do my homework. I felt really blessed that wherever it came from, it spent some time in my backyard. A more dramatic moment when God showed up was when I was in the third grade and it was Easter break. Like most kids, I love Lego and building things with Lego. On this particular occasion, I accidentally swallowed the Lego piece. I was rushed to hospital where doctors watched me for a day and night, hoping that the Lego piece would make a natural exit. <laughs> they took x-rays, but because the piece was plastic, the x-rays didn't show where it was. However, the surgeon who removed it says that it had gone down my windpipe instead of my esophagus. I have it here in this little bottle as a testimony of God's grace in my life. I have shared with you some of the... T <laughs> I have shared with you some of the times that God had my back, and that shows me that I am a child of God. Some of moments were more dramatic than others. Sometimes I noticed that God was there, and other times I didn't realize until afterwards. But when you check it out, I now see that God was there all along, and so it is. Amen.